Hey guys, Nick Holden here, aka DVD Collector 96, and welcome to a new video on my YouTube channel. Okay guys, so welcome to a new unboxing and review. I'm super super excited to be unboxing this uh, specific steelbook on the channel. I'm sorry, I know I'm a little behind. Um, the idea was to unbox this one as soon as it came to me, it came to me. The release was last Tuesday, I got it on Thursday, I've been busy, I'm recording this on a Friday night. Not even Friday, sorry, my mind, I'm recording this on a Saturday night. So I've been like busy doing extra stuff, I went out yesterday, so... Now is the time for me to sit down here with my collection and be able to do the unboxing. So the movie we're going to be unboxing today is uh, the Marvel's Walmart 4K exclusive steelbook. Why is this one important? I know not a lot of person love the movie. I personally have a lot of fun watching it when I went to the movie theaters. And this is the very first uh, steelbook release after Best Buy drop from Physical Media. Uh, the previous to this one, if you remember, it was the Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3, Vol Volume 3 uh, 4K Best Buy exclusive steelbook, which uh, there is an unboxing on the channel if you're interested in that. And this is the first one after those news. Uh, in the beginning, I thought that they were going to start getting released through the Disney Movie Club or through like Amazon and places like that. But no, they choose Walmart to give the steelbook collection. Uh, this is Disney and Warner Brothers did the same. So uh, it seems like most of the steelbook releases exclusives are going to be part of the Walmart collection, which I'm pretty glad. Uh, last week, I did got the Hunger Games, which the video is already on the channel. And also I got this one, they were pretty secure on an envelope, but I do not have any complaints. Both of the seal books show up pretty early on. Uh, the Hunger Games and this one came a day later. They shipped via FedEx, they were safe, they look flawless. I have seen a lot of people going to Walmart, so I've seen on stock, so that's always good news. And uh, if you're interested in seeing all the releases that you can choose from, I did a video on the channel already, so you can go ahead and get uh, to see that one. So, I was waiting for this steelbook to record a second video, which will be my complete Marvel collection 4K steelbooks. As of today, I have every single Marvel movie released on 4K steelbook. So I'm pretty proud of that. I um, wanted to do a video and you guys are going to be seeing a lot of unboxing Sundays on the channel really soon. There is going to be a digital codes, a lot of digital codes giveaway. So the Marvels, you need to you don't need to, but uh, you will understand that a lot better if you have seen Captain Marvel, of course, WandaVision, the complete first season, and Miss Marvel, the complete first season, because this is a theme uh, that the Marvel has become because of these three characters coming together uh, to get a fight. The post credit scene on this uh, movie, spoiler alert, we actually get to see the X-Men for the first time as part of this new MCU. Uh, and the movie overall, it's not the best Marvel movie, it doesn't even get to two hours long, but I enjoy it. Um, I have seen a lot of people saying that the Marvel Universe is not the same after Avengers Endgame, and of course we're always going to miss our original Avengers and things like that, but I've seen on most of the movies they have done a pretty good job, they still entertaining, I love the story, I kind of love where they're going, but it's kind of hard to follow a universe for so many years uh, with like, actual humans getting needing to get in contracts, people don't want to play the same character for so many years, so that's always going to be something that for us fans of movies or TV shows, we need to think about those things. Uh, imagine you being on a place that maybe you just want to work for two years, three years, even if you have amazing benefits or whatever, uh, it's something that we need to respect. For example, Crypt Hamburg wanted to continue with the MCU and we got uh, Tor 4 and we're going to get a fifth, if I'm not mistaken, but uh, today is time for the Marvels. Let's see what this steelbook brings to us. So, uh, this is, like I told you, the Walmart exclusive steelbook. You can only get this one through Walmart. Um, I got it for $34.99, so regular price. I didn't higher up the prices. And in this case, this one actually does come with the logo only at Walmart right there. The Hunger Games one didn't have the Walmart logo at all. So in this case, we got the 4K Ultra HD plus Blu-ray plus digital code of Marvel Studios The Marvels. And then, of course, this is a limited edition collectible steelbook. There is the background right there. And I think the 
uh, poster overall that they choose for this one is amazing. I did enjoy the 4K as well, but again, I spent a lot of money and I'm touching this because this is where my steelbooks are. Getting my complete collection of steelbooks, so I will continue at least until they continue releasing steelbooks, collecting steelbooks. I know they're a little bit pricey, but I just love the way they are. So basically, that's how our steelbook looks in the front. Then on our spine, uh, of course, the logo of the Ultra HD and the logo of the movie. And then uh, this is our background. I discuss a lot more about all the special features on every single release on that video that I told you with the complete uh, releases. So if you're interested in choosing one, that's your video. So higher, further, faster, together. Carol Denvers, aka Captain Marvel, has reclaimed her identity from the tyr tyrannical Kree when her duties send her to an anomalous uh, wormhole. Her powers are entangled with superfan Kamala Khan, aka Miss Marvel, and Carol's strangest niece, astronaut Captain Monica Rambo. Together, this unlikely trio must team up and work together to save the universe. And as usual, we're going to be getting a special features on this release. And I'm going to keep saying forever, one of the things that I love the most about collecting physical media is the special features that you get. So in this case, as bonus features that of course, uh, bonus varies by format, we have Entangle. Take a cosmic trip behind the scenes with Cass and crew. We also have the production Diaries. Join Brian Larson, Tejoni Paris and Iman Bellani for some sad fun and candid moments. We also have a gag reel, deleted scenes, and we also have an audio commentary with director Nia De Cosa and BFX supervisor Tara DiMarco. Of course, uh, this movie, the digital code is redeemable to movies anywhere since it's a Disney release. And in this case, guys, you can enjoy the movie with English Dolby Atmos and 2.0 Dolby Digital Descriptive Audio. A Spanish 7.1 Dolby Digital Plus and French 5.1 Dolby Digital Language Tracks. Also, you will get subtitles in English, HDH, Spanish, and French subtitles as well. So basically, basically, sorry, uh, that's what you get. Uh, the movie has an approximate runtime of 105 minutes. That for a Marvel, that's not a lot. So let's go ahead and unbox it. This has been sitting here on my shelf for a while, so I was dying to be able to sit down here and record this video. So let's take out the string wrap. Okay. So beautiful, string wrap is out. Surprise, surprise. The G car come out without a glue sticker on it or anything. That's the G car for you all. As I've been showing you on past videos, what I do is I fold it and keep it inside my seal book. And now this is how the steel book looks like without the G car. Beautiful art on it, but wait for the back. We have the little car right there, and it's kind of shiny. Not on the front. It's kind of shiny with the colors that they choose, like space related. Like I actually love that. Let's see what waits us in the inside. So as usual, we have here our digital code that will give us the digital movie with some special features, and it also gives you points on Disney movie rewards. And then we have our this here. Since this is a still book release, we have both these with our on it, which I always enjoy. Uh, our 4K is full of cats. Can't complain about that. And then our Blu-ray has the poster art that they choose for the regular 4K with a slipcover edition. <coughs> Sorry, which is super cool as well. And then on the background, we have the beautiful, beautiful kitty uh, background. This is a funny steel book for a funny movie. I love the musical moment of this movie. So out of 10, I want to say I give this movie around a 7, 8 points. I did actually enjoy it. I have seen a lot of people discover an outro this movie plot. So give it an opportunity if you haven't seen it. This is still the MCU. But, but guys, basically for now, that will be all for today's video. Like I always say, I hope you guys are enjoying with this new kind of content in the channel. If you are, please let me know in the comments. Leave me a like. And please subscribe to my YouTube channel so we can keep this family growing. And see you guys again soon on a new video.